In this video, I'm going to show you how to register or renew an ENS domain for under one year. And if you like these quick, simple tips, make sure to hit the like button. And with that being said, let's get into the content. Welcome aboard the Bitcoin Express. My name is Chase. Let's get to it. When you register or renew an ENS domain, it will be set by default in full years, one year, two year, three year, and so on. The problem is when you register a three character ENS domain, the renewal fee is $640 a year. For five digit or four digit, it is a lot less. For a five digit ENS, it is $5 a year to renew. And for a four character name, it is $160 a year to renew. But like we said, three digits, the ones that people actually buy and pay attention to, $640 a year. So I'm gonna show you how to do it for less than a year. ENS.vision is a website that places all of the top ENSs in one spot, the top categories. And you'll notice the top categories are usually three digits or three letters in different languages. So for example, if we look at the 999 Hindi Club, we can see that the cheapest ones have an expiration date coming up, one month, one month, three weeks, three weeks, meaning that someone can buy these NFTs and then just three weeks later, they have to pay a renewal fee for an NFT or an ENS they may not want to hold on to for a full year. Over here as well, Arabic 999 Club, we can see the cheapest ones on the floor have an upcoming expiration date, one month, one week, three weeks, and so on. So let's say, for example, we want to get this NFT over here that has an expiration date of one week, and we don't want to renew it for a full year. So if we go to ENS and we look up this ENS, we can see it's expiring soon. So we head over to it and we can extend. And by the way, don't extend an ENS that you don't actually own. I'm just using this one as an example, right? You only want to extend it once it's actually in your possession. And over here, instead of using these plus and minuses for one or two years, simply put a decimal in front of it and it will be in months rather than years. So let's say we only want it for a quarter of the year, three months out of the year, then we can do 0.25 and we can renew it for a shorter period because we may be buying these NFTs or these ENS domains in order to flip them, not necessarily to hold on to them for long term. So again, if you like these quick tips, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Thank you for listening and I'll see you next time.